Under which legal doctrine can an employer be held liable for the wrongful actions of its employees that were committed within the scope of their employment? A. Vicarious liability. B. Respondeat superior. C. Negligence per se. D. Contributory negligence. Which constitutional clause prohibits the government from making any law respecting an establishment of religion? A. Free Exercise Clause B. Due Process Clause C. Establishment Clause D. Equal Protection Clause Under the statute of frauds, which type of agreement related to real property must be in writing to be enforceable? A. Leases under one year. B. Oral agreements for the sale of real property. C. Verbal easements. D. Handshake agreements. What constitutional principle requires that an individual be informed of their rights when taken into custody and before being interrogated by law enforcement? A. Exclusionary rule. B. Due process. C. Miranda rights. D. Habeas corpus. What defense allows a defendant to avoid liability for their tortious conduct if the plaintiff voluntarily assumed the risk of potential harm? A. Contributory negligence. B. Comparative fault. C. Assumption of risk. D. Strict liability. Which federal agency is responsible for enforcing laws related to unfair and deceptive business practices, such as false advertising and consumer protection? A. Federal Trade Commission B. Securities and Exchange Commission C. Environmental Protection Commission D. Occupational Safety and Health Administration In criminal cases, the government must prove the defendant's guilt beyond a reasonable doubt. Which constitutional principle does this reflect? A. Right to a fair trial. B. Right to due process. C. Right to confront witnesses. D. Right to counsel. What is the legal document that establishes a formal relationship between a trustee, who holds legal title, and beneficiaries, who hold equitable title to the trust property? A. Deed of Trust B. Mortgage C. Lease Agreement D. Trust Agreement Under which constitutional clause can Congress regulate interstate commerce? A. Supremacy Clause B. Necessary and C. Interstate Commerce Clause D. Establishment Clause What is the primary purpose of the Sherman Antitrust Act? A to regulate workplace safety. B. To protect intellectual property. C. To prevent monopolistic practices. D. To ensure environmental compliance. Which type of easement benefits a specific piece of land and is attached to the land, regardless of the owner? A. Easement by necessity. B. Easement in gross. C. Prescriptive easement. D. License.
What legal doctrine allows a person to acquire title to abandoned property by occupying and using it openly and exclusively for a certain period? A. Condemnation. B. Escheat. C. Accession. D. Adverse possession. Which test is used to determine whether a law that restricts speech is constitutionally permissible? A. Rational basis test. B. Intermediate scrutiny test. C. Strict scrutiny test. D. Balancing test. Under which doctrine can a plaintiff be barred from recovering damages if their own negligence contributed to their injuries, even if the defendant's negligence was the primary cause? A. Assumption of risk. B. Comparative negligence. C. Contributory negligence. D. Strict liability. What legal doctrine allows a party to terminate a contract due to a significant and unforeseen event that makes performance impossible or commercially impracticable? A. Rescission. B. Novation. C. Force majeure. D. Accord and satisfaction. Under the Equal Protection Clause of the 14th Amendment, a state law that treats men and women differently will be subject to which level of scrutiny? A. Rational Basis Review B. Intermediate Scrutiny C. Strict Scrutiny D. Minimal Scrutiny Which legal doctrine permits a property owner to transfer their property after death, avoiding probate by specifying beneficiaries and conditions in a legal document? A. Condemnation B. Eminent domain C. In state succession D. Transfer on death Which test is applied to laws that classify individuals based on their gender or legitimacy? A. Rational basis test. B. Intermediate scrutiny test. C. Strict scrutiny test. D. Balancing test. What is the legal principle that holds a person liable for the actions of their employees or agents when they are acting within the scope of their employment? A. Respondiat superior. B. Contributory negligence. C. Assumption of risk. D. Comparative fault. Which business entity offers both limited liability for its members and the pass-through taxation characteristic of partnerships? A. Sole proprietorship B. General partnership C. Limited liability company D. Corporation Which of the following entities is typically characterized by limited liability for its owners, who are called shareholders? A. Sole proprietorship. B. General partnership. C. Limited liability company. D. Corporation. Which type of speech is given the least protection under the First Amendment? A. Political speech B. Commercial speech C. Artistic expression D. Religious speech
Which principle holds that landowners have an implied duty to use their property in a way that does not harm adjacent landowners? A. Doctrine of Advessor Possession B. Doctrine of Constructive Eviction C. Doctrine of Lateral Support D. Doctrine of Exclusion Which constitutional amendment protects individuals from double jeopardy? A. First Amendment B. Third Amendment C. Fourth Amendment D. Fifth Amendment Which intentional tort involves the unlawful physical restraint of another person's freedom of movement? A. Assault B. False imprisonment C. Battery D. Invasion of privacy Which federal law requires companies to provide clear and accurate information about the risks and benefits of securities they offer to the public? A. Sherman Antitrust Act B. Sarbanes-Oxley Act C. Securities Act of 1933 D. Dodd-Frank Wall Street Reform and Consumer Protection Act Which amendment protects individuals from unreasonable searches and seizures? A. First Amendment B. Second Amendment C. Fourth Amendment D. Fifth Amendment Which covenant in a general warranty deed promises that the grantor has good title and the right to convey the property? A. Covenant of Season B. Covenant Against Encumbrances C. Covenant of Quiet Enjoyment D. Covenant of Warranty Forever Which clause of the United States Constitution prohibits the government from taking private property for public use without just compensation? A. Due Process Clause B. Equal Protection Clause C. Eminent Domain Clause D. Takings Clause What type of tort involves intentional conduct that causes emotional distress to another person through outrageous behavior? A. Negligence B. Assault C. Battery D. Intentional infliction of emotional distress Which federal agency enforces laws related to workplace safety and health? A. Department of Labor B. Equal Employment Opportunity Commission C. Occupational Safety and Health Administration D. Federal Trade Commission Which provision of the United States Constitution guarantees the right to freedom of speech? A. First Amendment B. Second Amendment C. Fourth Amendment D. Fifth Amendment What is the legal principle that limits a property owner's rights to use their property in a way that unreasonably interferes with another's use and enjoyment of their property? A. Nuisance Doctrine B. Eminent Domain C. Fee Simple Absolute D. Permissive Use Principle
Which constitutional standard is applied to laws that classify individuals based on gender? A. Rational Basis Review B. Intermediate Scrutiny C. Strict Scrutiny D. Minimal Scrutiny What is the legal principle that allows an injured party to recover damages even if they were partially at fault, with their damages reduced by their percentage of fault? A. Strict liability. B. Contributory negligence. C. Assumption of risk. D. Comparative fault. What term refers to the legal process through which property is transferred from a decedent to their heirs or beneficiaries? A. Probate B. Estate planning C. Trust administration D. Property partition Which constitutional amendment protects individuals from cruel and unusual punishment? A. First Amendment B. Eighth Amendment C. Tenth Amendment D. Fourteenth Amendment What is the legal doctrine that holds manufacturers, distributors, and sellers liable for placing defective products in the hands of consumers? A. Strict liability. B. Intentional infliction of emotional distress. C. Comparative fault. D. Assumption of risk. Under which legal principle can a court disregard the separate legal entity status of a corporation and hold its shareholders personally liable for the corporation's actions? A. Limited liability doctrine. B. Piercing the corporate veil. C. Shareholder immunity rule. D. Business judgment rule. In a lease agreement, what is the tenant's obligation to use the property in a responsible and lawful manner called? A. Covenant of Quiet Enjoyment B. Covenant to Repair C. Covenant of Habitability D. Covenant of Good Use Which constitutional standard is applied to laws that classify individuals based on their race? A. Rational Basis Review B. Intermediate Scrutiny C. Strict Scrutiny D. Minimal Scrutiny In a defamation claim, what type of defamation involves making false statements in written or printed form? A. Slander B. Libel C. Invasion of privacy D. Fraud In a contract, what is the legal term for the party who receives a promise or consideration from the other party? A. Offeror B. Offeree C. Obligor D. Promiser Which legal document provides notice of a pending lawsuit involving real property and serves to preserve the property's value until the lawsuit is resolved? A. Quitclaim deed B. Subordination agreement C. Lease pendens D. Covenant against encumbrances
Which clause of the United States Constitution ensures that state laws do not violate federal laws or the Constitution? A. Supremacy Clause B. Due Process Clause C. Equal Protection Clause D. Necessary and Proper Clause Which doctrine allows a landowner to be held liable for injuries sustained by individuals on their property, even if the injured person was not invited or authorized to be there? A. Negligence per se. B. Attractive nuisance doctrine. C. Residential ipsiloquitur. D. No duty doctrine. Which federal law provides protection against discrimination based on race, color, religion, sex, or national origin in various aspects of employment? A. Age discrimination.